hi guys welcome to our chichi's secret and today i'm going to be showing you how to turn this wet pap into a long lasting dry pap this pap can last you for as long as six months to one year without going bad the last one we made lasted for about five months and we enjoyed it thoroughly when you prepare this pap as a meal this is the kind of result you'll be getting. If you'd like to know how I made it, then keep watching. So first, I'll be stirring some of the wet pap in my fridge to be consumed over the next few days. And next, these are the ones we'll be working with. To get started, I'll be putting all of them in an oven rack. And I'm spreading it out evenly just to make sure that it's properly oven dried. Usually I do this under sunlight but it's been raining for the past few days. For the first time I've decided to try using the oven. The idea is to dry out completely the water in this pump. Remember that moisture in anything makes attracts bacteria and that's what spoils that thing. So we're trying to remove all the water in it so i'm going to be oven drying but at a really really low temperature first i'm just heating up at 130 but eventually i'm going to reduce it to about 50 degrees so at this point the pap is a bit dry not really dry but it's wet dry so i'm going to be leaving it overnight under a kitchen fan and yeah and then this is the next morning and i can see that it's completely dry I know it's completely dry because when you touch it, it breaks into powder already. So the next thing is for me to blend it into a powder. And here, yeah, after blending, it's still a bit coarse. So I'm going to go in with my sieve to sieve out this powder just to make it really fine so that when you prepare the meal, it's really clean. So even this part I sieved, I still blended it. And here is the powder I have here. Our pap powder is ready, completely ready, and this can be stored for as long as you want. Like I mentioned earlier, the last one we made lasted for about five months without any like change in taste or anything. So this can last for as long as you want. And for those who are interested in business, you can also package this to sell so the best thing is to store in an airtight container just you know to be on the safe side just store in an airtight container so i'm actually going to be showing you how to make the pap meal if you haven't seen my previous video on how to um, make the pap meal kindly click on the link above to watch it so i'm just going to be adding a bit of water to dissolve after this i'm just going to be cooking in the pot for just two minutes and our pop will be ready to be served so now i'm just staring and that's it guys our pop meal is ready so i have lots more videos like this coming up and you don't want to miss out so don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys in my next video